everyone today we'll have the last part of the how to pass qc first year examination of mathematics subject in which we are going to talk about the part 4 which is uh, of 5 marks and the part e is of 6 plus 4 that is 10 marks so in the part 4 you need to write most probably six questions so we have the first one prove that type of problem from trigonometry there will be a prove that problem left hand side equal to right hand side then we have a prove by using principle of the mathematical induction so that is we have only one type of problem in there which one is very big five marks then we have the inequalities graphical method problem you will be given with the equations to solve that and you need to find out the values and plot the graph Finally, we have the theorem, binomial theorem. It is very, very important theorem. It is mostly asked. So we have included this also. And derivation from the straight lines and uh, derivation from the 3D geometry. These both derivations, whatever we are getting, so it is very uh, small, not very length, lengthy. Therefore, they might ask you about some examples, uh, some problems along with this in the sub question. Then we have from the limit chapter, sin x by x is equal to 1 proof we have to do the proof and uh, may they may ask you about the evaluate type of problem in this finally we have the to find the mean deviation from statistics about the mean and mean and variance and the standard of deviation so the last part is of two that is six plus four one question will be six and the b question will be four marks so we have written separately here two questions six marks which we are getting is definite is on the chronic section so which is a very uh, which can say ellipse we have ellipse parabola hyperbola and circle in which ellipse is very important then you can go for the hyperbola and this is also a very fixed question from the trigonometry part to derive the expression for cos x plus y and sometimes they will ask you to find out the value of uh, 75 degree cos like that so you need to solve this problem in the four marks that is the b part of this will be they will take the combination of a and b a is uh, six marks and b is the four marks so b will be from the um, series chart that is progressions what we call sum of n terms then we have to find the limits and derivatives problem again are with, with, with respect to x we have to differentiate so these are the six plus four ten marks problem so almost you will have around more than 30 to 40 marks you will get this if you study this part 4 and part 5 that is part d and part e so overall whatever i have shown you you can almost write about 60 to 70 marks you can achieve it easily so all the best for the your future examination from the pace academy see you again in the next videos thank you